lady and she had history of short amenorrhea followed by dnc about one month back mm -hmm. and since then she has difficulty in defecation and also micturition and lower abdominal pain and today she comes for evolution uh, of uterus and adnexia uh, we have done the Transvaginal examination. This is the long section of uterus. This is the endometrial cavity, and there is uh, thick fluid in uh, pouch of Douglas and also in adnexia. This is the long section, and this is the short section, and this is the fluid. This is the uh, left ovary. This is the transverse section. And this is the fluid in pelvic cavity, free fluid in pelvic cavity. And this is her right uterus, a uh, right ovary. And here is a solid mass. I think this is a clotted blood. This is the irregular mass adherent to it, right ovary. And this is the left ovary, which is in uh, and trapped in posterior cul-de-sac. This is the fluid and this is the left ovary. Here, this is the clip, this is the free fluid, septation also seen, and this is the flu fluid in both adnexia and in posterior cul-de-sac, and there is a solid mass uh, uh, in right adnexia, uh, irregular solid marks, uh, uh, along with right ovary. This is a solid mass, solid mass, this is the right ovary, and this is the left ovary, this is the fluid collection, this is the free fluid collection in both adnexia, and this is the solid mass, and this is the left ovary. So does it uh, a uh, chronic ectopic pregnancy, rupture ectopic pregnancy, or it may be iatrogenic perforation of uterus during uh, DNC. Uh, I am in Delima, and this uh, is this is the marked fluid correction again. This is the marked fluid collection. Uh, this is the left ovary in adnexia, posterior cul-de-sac. This is the fluid in left adnexia. And this is the right adnexia fluid with a solid irregular mass along with the right ovary. So I am now examining the patient in, uh, this is the, patient uh, this is the short section this is the short section and this is the long section and this is the fluid in left uh, adnexia and the left ovary is entrapped in posterior cul-de-sac and uh, here is the uh, marked separated fluid collection in right adnexia right ovary uh, is visualized along with a, an irregular heterogeneous mass I think this is a uh, organized blood clot. So uh, I will ask the patient to do a, an X-ray abdomen uh, in erect posture, uh, whether there is any, any free fluid, uh, free gas under dome of diaphragm, and also to do the uh, beta SCG. So this is. Uh, interesting case and I am sending to it to you all uh, for sharing thanks